Okay, so this is how we are looking before the hot oil treatment. Her hair has came out of a two-week protective hairstyle, and I've just sectioned it and removed all the shed hair from the past two weeks. So to begin the hot oil treatment, I microwave some water for about five minutes, and I let it sit in the water for about 15 minutes while I washed her hair. Okay, so I'm starting the process on freshly washed condition and detangled hair i'll leave my wash routine down below so you guys can check that out and following the wash routine i do this step whenever her hair needs a lot more moisture we've been having 20 degree days and her hair has definitely been really really dry so i begin by dividing her hair into sections this is just going to make doing the hot oil treatment much easier for me I'm testing the temperature of the oil to make sure it's hot but it's not scolding hot. She's letting me know that it's not hot. So I'm going to go ahead and begin adding it to her hair, concentrating on her scalp first. This does get messy so make sure you guys have a towel. So I'm using the Taylor Beauty Grow Thick Oil which of course is the oil from my line. This oil, I cannot express how good this oil is. It has seven great oils, which is castor oil, which we all know aids in hair growth and thickness. Sesame seed oil, which contains a lot of fatty acids that aid in hair growth. Almond oil, which increases blood circulation. Apricot oil, which protects the hair from damage and dryness. Jojoba oil, which keeps it moisturized and it also acts as a humectant. And vitamin E oil, which is great for keeping the scalp healthy, and rosemary oil, which aids in hair growth. Okay, so now it's time for me to add the oil into her hair, and I begin by adding it to her scalp and massaging it into her scalp. The reason why I do massage it into her scalp is because of all the oils that I mentioned that stimulate the hair growth, increase blood circulation. This is actually going to help really get the real benefits of the oil. So here I am just massaging it into her scalp. And the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to work it into her entire hair. Because not only do I want it in her scalp, I want it in her hair of course because her hair is really, really dry. So as I mentioned before, make sure you have a towel because this can get a little bit messy. So once I feel like I've worked it into that entire section, she's helping me too, I begin to just twist it up. This is going to help separate each section and make sure I get the most oil into each section. So how do I know if her hair needs a hot oil treatment? Well, I really assess her skin during this time of year. Her skin gets really dry and her lips get really chapped. So that's an indication that her hair is also very dry. Also, sometimes you can just feel the difference of the hair um, as opposed to well moisturized hair. So I'll do hot oil treatments at that time. Type 4 hair really benefits from hot over treatments in general because the hair needs more moisture. If your hair is more fine, then the oil might be a little too heavy for you, so just keep that in mind. The oil does have a very thick consistency, so it's either good for everyday use or, as seen in the video, for a hot oil treatment. So to continue, I just go ahead and I'll add a plastic cap to her head and I'll let that sit for about 20 to 30 minutes while the oil is still hot and it kind of builds steam from her body heat. Another added step that you can do is sit under a hooded dryer. I let her sit under a hooded dryer for 10 minutes and then once we're done, we go ahead and rinse out. So here is her hair all rinsed out. After I completed the hot oil treatment, I just rinsed all the oil out. It'll still have a lot of oil in it. You just want to get all of the excess hot oil out. And here are my results. Her hair is nice, it's shiny, and it's very well moisturized. Thumbs up if you found this video helpful. Let me know if you've done a hot oil treatment with Taylor Beauty Grow Thick Oil. Be sure to check out my social networks as well as reviews and thanks for watching.